Time now 702 and local education for you this morning. We're one month into the new school year and administrators don't want the excitement of that fresh start to fade too fast. On the first day of school, school administration, faculty and community members stood outside several schools greeting students with high fives and motivational words. CW 30's Jude Fratina's live force at Hickory Hill this morning. Jude, school leaders don't want it to stop. They want to see a repeat. Well, school leaders across the district and community members are asking you at home to help them encourage students on a daily basis. Now, one of the key players in this movement joining me now, Anthony Sledge, he's with Alpha Phi Alpha Fraternity here in Memphis. Anthony, talk about that first day of school when you were out here with your fraternity brothers and you all were encouraging the students. What was that like? Well, it was, it was very exhilarating. The first day of school was exciting. I think the kids were excited to see new faces, encouraging them to have a great day and, and, and a good week. Now, many of these students, uh, low-income families, no father at home, how important is it that they see a male role model who can encourage them to keep achieving success? Well, it's extremely important, I think, to know that somebody's caring about their future and on, on their behalf and giving them the support that they need and somebody that they don't even know but know that their presence is there. Now talk about, I mean, I know you are a father yourself, so how important is it to reach these kids at a young age to make sure that they grow up and still have these values that are so important? Because if you don't reach them young, you know, it's so hard to change that mindset when they're older. Right. I think it's very important to, think, to get them at the, at the young age where we can have an impact in their lives and then give them something positive to look at instead of some of the negative things that are in the community as well. And it takes little to no time. I mean, maybe 10 minutes of your time to send out here and encourage them. What are some of the words you hear back from the students of gratitude? Uh, well, they, they say thank you. Uh, they high five us. They, uh, they, you know, you look like my papa. Uh, and so it's exhilarating. Uh, it's fun. Again, it's, it's having an impact in their lives. And we're glad to put a, a central, essential part of that in their lives. And I know you all want so many volunteers that you all can be stationed at schools across the district instead of just one school district a week. Right. We have several schools that call us and, and we uh, delegate between the brotherhood and see if we can get up in the morning before we go to our individual jobs and make it happen. So we're excited. We're ex very ex excited about doing it and enthusiastic about it at the same time. All right. Thank you so much, Anthony. Now, if you want to take part, all you need to do is contact the principal of the school you are interested in. We're told as soon as you do, they'll put you to work. Reporting live in Hickory Hill, Gene A. Francine, CW 30 Morning News.